What's up guys, Puck Mike here back with another video. And today I am going to be opening uh, some random packs of hockey cards. This is a little mini series I'm gonna be doing here. So um, yeah, I'm not gonna go through the packs first. I'm gonna go through the packs as I actually open them. So first up here is, um, this is actually a sticker pack. I don't really regularly buy stickers, nor will I buy stickers, but um, where I buy my cards, they threw this in for free when I bought some cards. So why not? I was going to get rid of them, but then actually after I got it, I was like, actually, these could be kind of cool for some of the boxes I have where I store my cards. So uh, I figured why not? We got an Ovechkin left wing. Um, not too bad. Okay. We got a... Uh, Chris Letang, that's pretty cool. John Tavares, some good names, good names so far. Um, JT Comfort and this fancy looking one on the back here. What we got? Blades, Boston Bruins. Now, why couldn't that have been Iceberg? Um, that's pretty cool. That's awesome. So, yeah, that's actually my first sticker pack. So, there you go. Um, next one here, uh, this was pretty cheap when I was placing an order with someone, Beehive. Um, 06, 07, never opened one of these. Honestly, have no idea what you can get in here. Um, yeah, I mean, doesn't actually look like there's any crazy stuff, just some redemption. So I have no idea what to expect in here, but from 06, 07, I mean, pretty cool, right? Let's see. Jeff Garter, okay. Now on the Penguins. Patrick Elias. Daniel Alfredson, and last up here, Eric Stahl. So just, just pretty basic, um, pretty basic set, but bought it because I never heard of it and I wanted to open them. So let's get into some more interesting stuff here. 2020, 2021 Allure. So you can get some low rare uh, jersey and autograph cards. I actually went to a local card shop um, recently. I'm, I just bought a few of these packs there. I'm not gonna buy stuff there regularly because the guy had stuff priced so unbelievably uh expensive but um there was a box of 2020 2021 allure but i mean he had it so priced so high i was like i can't do that but i love these gloss cards similar to like the opg platinum this is my first actual allure that i've ever opened so um yeah you're witnessing history right here thomas hurdle martin i don't know how to say that name Alexander Barkov, looks like we got some inserts here. Ryan Getzlaff just announced his retirement. Uh, Bo Horvat, yeah, Getzlaff is retiring at the end of this year, so. Um, and Thomas Shabbat on the last card here. Not sure what kind of insert this is. Like I said, I'm not, not familiar with any of the Allure stuff, but um, yeah, these cards are pretty cool. I like them. I like them a lot. So there you go on that one. Next up, MVP 2021-2022. I said I wasn't going to open this stuff. And then it was it's like 50 bucks for a hobby box. And I was like, why not? It's a pretty entry-level product. Um, but I had a lot of fun opening that box. And I actually really like these cards. So I think I'll probably be doing MVP every year. Chitrin. Uh, ch ch Chikrin, Chitrin, Besser, Carlson. You can get the mascots in here. You can get, um, um, I was going to say, I couldn't remember what it was called. Heart attack, um, but also before and after as well. Evander Kane, not not the best one to have, but uh, Johnny Gaudreau, Connor Brown, and Alex Newhook. So we're not getting um, a ton of crazy stuff yet, but... Saving the best for last over here. This is, um, got a few of these on Etsy. Uh, Tim Hortons, three cards in these. This is from 1516. So, um, yeah, who knows? You can, 1516. I really like these cards, honestly. I love the, uh, Holby. The, uh, Holby. Um, I love the, um, the look of the Tim Hortons cards. Malcolm Subban, very nice. This guy has, I think, a, a really good future. Um, he just needs to get on the right team. And I think maybe he did find it with Buffalo. If Buffalo can get their crap together and stop doing this, whatever they're doing. I mean, you got so many good prospects in the system. Then you get some veterans that can really help them win. Um, Subban might be in the right spot there. Yeah, that's a good card. 
And then what we got a Steve Mason. Okay. Um, pretty excited about the Malcolm Subban though. That one's pretty cool. All right. So we have 27, 2018 Upper Deck Series 2. Um, Young Guns in here. There's some decent names. Um, nothing super crazy. I would, um, I'd love to have Nadelkovic, honestly. I know he's, I think he's on the Red Wings now, but, um, yeah, I would, I'd be happy with, I'd be happy with him if I, if we could pull his young guns. Steen, David, Desjardins, got a Paige Thompson, UD Portraits, that's awesome. I, I actually bought his young guns, so that's pretty cool. Um... Mark Giordano, and got a base there of Chad Ruweedle. A little bit uh, rough on the top there, so that's not so good, but um, that's good to have in the Penguins collection. So next here, 2020-2021 um, Series 1. So still hunting Lafreniere's Young Guns because I refuse to pay. <laughs> It'll be the same story with Lafreniere and Kaprizov that I refuse to pay. Tons of money for it, and by the end, I could have just bought it instead of buying all the packs I bought searching for them. But, hey, this is the fun of it, right? Um, still on the hunt for on the hunt for Lafreniere. But we got a Nikita Gusev, um, Alex Ovechkin, got a Jake Gensel, Braden Point, Nate Schmidt. Doesn't look like we're going to get a Young Guns. Got a Goligoski, a Cassian, and, yeah, just a base pack. Bummer. And a Kirby Dock, unfortunately. Um, but there's still hope. So this is actually, this would be the hunt of, um, the Kirill Kaprizov 2021, 2020, 2021 series two. I don't actually know if there's young guns in these fat packs. Um, but I know there's other inserts like the UD canvas and OPG update. So, um, 26 cards in here. So let's see what we can get out of this one. I would think we'd get at least one young guns for goodness sakes but you never know so we got a jacob slavin ryan johansson cam fowler this is going to be mostly base i think justin falk kevin bank philip cheetle heedle i think Cheadle. anthony bovillier chris tyranny jonathan huberdo anti ranta so we get something back here um ooh, there is a young guns Altieri Philpola, it's not Lafreniere. I know that. Jordan Stahl. Braden Burke. Braden Burke. Who are you, Braden Burke? 1997. So, um, 25. So, eh, not the best one there. Um, I'll have to look up his stats. But, hey, at least we got a young guns, right? Ryan Pollock. Miro Heiskanen. Andre Palat. Jacob Voracek. Pecorine, Chris Kreider, Zach Aston Reese, Mackenzie Blackwood, Lemieux, Rihanna Brown, Bailey, and Vladislav Gavrikov. So nothing super spectacular in that one. We did get a young gun, so can't complain, right? And then last up here on the list, I'm going to do a 2021-2022 OPG hockey fat pack. I've opened a lot of 2021-2022 OPG, probably more than I want to and will in the future. Um, I did a hobby box. I did a blaster. Um, I have a fat pack here and I have another one too. Um, not a product I'm super in love with. Some of the inserts are growing on me, but definitely not my favorite. So um, yeah, I'm not sure how much we'll do in the future. Um, I'm going to try to say that one. Maxime Comtois, Jacob Silverberg, Jack Roslevic, Andrew Kopp. Jacob Larson, got a John Tavares, Brandon Tanev on the Penguins still, although he's on the Kraken now, or, well, he was on the Kraken, I can't remember if they traded him, Troy Terry, Tanner Janot, <laughs> actually got, um, okay, <laughs> I just, I just recorded a video of the blaster of OPG, and I actually got, literally got these two cards in that blaster, Janot and McDavid, but, I mean, those are good ones to have, so maybe I'll keep one, sell the other, um, <laughs> that's funny. Season highlights here, Patrick Kane. We got the Retro, Connor Garland, Josh Norris, Don Scoy, Mantha, Larson, Zaboro, Atkinson, Perot, Doesn't look like we're going to get any more inserts. Nope, no more. 
there you have it guys that's uh video number one of opening some random packs of hockey cards so i got some cool i got some cool pulls in there um i got the mcdavid one actually i'm really uh more excited about these stickers which i probably won't be able to resell for any for much if anything but um i'll probably throw these on some of the boxes i have these are kind of cool uh, yeah thank you guys so much for watching as always do me a favor hit the like and subscribe and i will check you later